Hi, and welcome to Mondays with Mike. Last week, we sponsored FJA's 2019 Masters of Justice Seminar in Orlando. Any attorney who is practicing or considering practicing plaintiff's personal injury law in Florida should join FJA. But don't take my word for it. We sat down with some veteran members as well as some of the younger leadership and asked them to tell us about what FJA does for its members. I would say to any young lawyer who's thinking about representing everyday people that they need to be part of the Florida Justice Association because it's only that organization in the state of Florida at least that will stand up for people and their rights in the Capitol and in any changes that are made in the Constitution and in the courts. So if you want to help people, then you want to be a part of the Florida Justice Association. The ability to change lives is only possible because of the work the FJA does. The FJA makes sure that the laws stay in place to keep our clients safe. And I think the best hope for the wrongfully injured victims of Florida and those who are representing them is the Florida Justice Association and getting together and presenting a united front and representing those interests, not just in the courts, but politically. And I think the FJA has been doing that for 40 years. As a woman, I think that um, we uh, need to support each other. And I've, through FJA, the Women's Caucus in particular, I've come to really feel that warmth and support of other women uh, that you might not find in other organizations even when they have a women's section. I don't, I don't know how you would practice plaintiff's personal injury work without being a member of the, the FJA. Um, it's been invaluable to me and my family and how we you know, handle these cases. Through my attendance at certain CLEs as well as uh, being uh, one of the members of the medical malpractice listserv where you have attorneys who have been practicing for 30 plus years giving advice to younger attorneys or to attorneys who have been practicing just as long um, I think that experience and having that resource uh, can only help enhance a younger attorney's practice. Without this organization, we wouldn't be able to do what we do uh, in, in achieving results for clients that are necessary for them to lead productive, productive lives. It is not even a question about whether to join the FJA or not. The FJA is the only organization that is looking out for the victims of negligence and we are vastly outnumbered when we go to Tallahassee. If you don't join the FJA, you're not going to know what's going on. You won't have access to the latest information about what's happening in Tallahassee, about changes to the law, to the FJA CLE, and the tremendous networking opportunities that FJA provides. It's a no-brainer. You have to join the FJA, no question.